Hello, this is Liz with DC Digital, and today I'm demonstrating a new product called the DC 302 T Down W. In this video, I'm going to go over how to use this product first and then follow up with hardware and features. So, this is going to be used as a two digit outdoor countdown timer, and it has a horn attached to it for an end of period beep, and it also has a remote control. And the functions on the remote are start, stop, reset to zero, set hours, set minutes, set seconds, and reset to last value. So the customer that ordered this only wanted to be able to set minutes. So I'm just gonna show you that function in this video. So what you're gonna do is press the set minutes button once, and the display is gonna start counting up the minutes and you're gonna press it again to stop. And then you can press the start stop button to start the timer. And when the timer ends, or if you need to stop the timer partway through the countdown, you can hit the last value button to reset it to the time that you last set the timer to. And then you can restart the timer again from there. And then I'm going to hit the last value button again. And you can continue counting up um, when, it, when you reset it to last value instead of pressing start and stop or zero. And this timer will go from zero to 99 in minutes. So you can count over an hour. And once it reaches 99, It'll go back to zero and then restart the count, um, the count cycle up again. Let me show you that. Oops, hit the set minutes, and then you can start it from there, and then press the zero reset button when the timer is stopped to reset it to zero. And then I'm just gonna do one minute. When the timer reaches below one minute, it'll start a countdown. It'll start the countdown showing seconds. So before, um, when it's greater than one minute, it'll show um, minutes with the tens and ones of the minute value. And then below one minute, it'll show the seconds. And the horn that's attached to the timer is a 122 decibel outdoor horn. It's normally not included in the timer, but the customer requested that we give them a three second end of period outdoor siren so that they can hear it um, from quite a bit of ways from the timer. So we will hear that in just a few seconds. <coughs> All right, and you may have noticed that the display said zero for about a second before the, t uh, before the horn went off. That's because on a four digit display, when it reaches zero on the seconds, there is still a uh, value counting down in the tenths and hundredths of a second. So on a two digit, on a two digit display, you don't get to see the tenths and hundredths, but it, they still have to count down for one second, which is why it shows zero for a second before the siren goes off. All right, so the digit size on this timer is gonna be 30 inch. They're individual red LEDs arranged into segments. The case is made out of powder-coated aluminum extrusion. And to mount it, there are two C-channel mounting rails on the back. Uh, for power, there is a junction box on the bottom right of the display. And there are pigtail wires, uh, green, white, and black. And those are labeled ground, or ground, neutral, and live. 
And in the junction box on the left, there are pigtail wires for the horn. And those are labeled common. And then there's a study and a um, Yelp. In this video, we had the siren attached. Um, we did not have the Yelp attached, but you can switch out the siren and the Yelp wires. Um, those are gonna be the yellow and red wires from the siren. And I believe that's it. So all of our products are manufactured and assembled at our location in Carlisle, Ohio. So if you like this product and want to order it, or if you have any questions about how we can customize any of our products for your specific needs, please contact us using the link in the description. Again, this has been Liz with DC Digital demonstrating a new product called the DC302T-W. Thank you.